Welcome to Parev TV. Today we are excited to have with us uh, Mr. Zaven Khanjan, the Chief Executive Officer of the Armenian Missionary Association of America. He was appointed to this position on September the 1st, 2014. And through this video, we hope to get to know the man, the aspirations, the dreams. Obviously, we all have dreams, especially when we serve Armenian organizations. And we'd like to hear more about the projects that Mr. Khanjan is uh, uh, interested in, hopes to promote and hopefully we as a community will support him in realizing his dream. Well, our, our main mission currently is in Armenia, of mm -hmm. course. The largest field, the largest mission is in Armenia. But the AMA has been serving outside Armenia, Armenians, outside of Armenia since 1918. <laughs> uh, the mission is global, uh, the fields are, are wide open, mm -hmm. uh, and of course the core uh, is of the Armenian population in all these places. Uh, I am continuously um, under stress in what's happening in Syria. Unfortunately, certainly with all our efforts, we can only do this much uh, to help our population, uh, our communities over there, uh, but we cannot solve the political problems that uh, arise there and where the big powers have their own play and Syria has become the focus of, of the Cold War again uh, that has uh, been re-emerged or emerged uh, uh, once again in the in the Middle East. Syria being that that cradle of of our existence after the genocide uh, has, over time, over the past 100 years, has given and given and given in in human resources to the diaspora. We're born in Yerazain Halep, as Antranik Targa. Mm -hmm called it. Uh, uh, Aleppo, uh, as I said a little while ago, has been the center uh, where our refugee population, where the remnants of the genocide took refuge and uh, settled right after the genocide. Uh, education and uh, literature introduce us to the causes that our parents took refuge in Aleppo. And after the initial elementary education, I continued my education at Aleppo College, which was again an Armenian evangelical institution. I graduated from high school there and then took off to Lebanon, uh, to the American University of Beirut for my higher education. I, after graduating from AUB, uh, I guess uh, uh, the real life uh, lessons uh, took us to, took me to the Persian Gulf. Uh, for employment opportunities were ample there. And so I spent around 13 years in the Persian Gulf. Uh, during that time, I got married uh, to Sona Keligyan. Uh, and uh, we had our children, uh, two of our sons were born in the, in the Persian Gulf. I spent around 13, 14 years there. Uh, uh, as our children were growing, we realized that uh, they needed real schools and we decided that it was time for us to go to Lebanon and establish there. Mm -hmm. But the uh, civil war in Lebanon uh, was the cause that uh, uh, with the winds uh, and uh, the growing uh, <coughs> exodus from the Middle East at the time uh, brought us to California where I landed in 1979. And for the past 35 years uh, I spent uh, uh, a lifetime uh, in California, again working within the community, uh, serving the community to, uh, uh, in, in parallel with my own business, of course. That when you're in the service of your community, it really doesn't make any difference where you are. It's uh, rewarding to serve the community, uh, and I'm really happy to be here and serve the AMA. And in life, I, I've chosen a, a motto that I've used both in business and in life. I care, therefore I am. Both my parents are from the Arabkir area. Mm. And, uh, my father was born in one of the villages of uh, Arabkir called Aghan. Mm -hmm. uh, and my mother was an Arabkir itself. Uh, I had the opportunity in 2008 of visiting Aghan, where my father was born in 2006 and uh, visited the house where actually my father was born. The owner of the house, who is a Turk, he asked me that question. 
and uh, it, it, it certainly gives you uh, a sense of, of deep, deep uh, thought and consideration as to what was the, the mental, the psychological condition of this guy when he put his hands around my shoulder and said, now tell me, is this your house or mine? He had the full knowledge of, of what had happened there. Yeah. Halep, uh, has a, Halep Arachinga Eran, uh, has also a subtitle, and I think that the subtitle is even more important. And it says, Mangutyun Unetso the woman who shared out. I think our challenges continue in the homeland. That remains our biggest center, our attention. The homeland we've seen in the past decade and the exodus of our population from there. As, as AMAA and any other, and all other Armenian institutions who care about the Armenian nation, who care about the Armenian home, homeland, we have to meet this challenge head on. I, I believe that in order for somebody's uh, life to be self-fulfilling, you have to serve a cause. Uh, and I, I encourage everyone to have a cause in life. And certainly, as, as Armenian people, if the causes are closer to us, certainly that makes sense. And that's why I invite everyone to, to nurture it, to engulf a cause, to nurture a cause, to support a cause uh, within the community, within the church, within the school, whatever it is. I think there are a lot of good causes that we can uh, we can support and sustain, and and if you believe that you can create a cause uh, that is unique uh, to you for you and, and in your thinking, you can go ahead and do that. But I think without that, really, you you don't have a focus and a purpose in life. I am coming Ein polorin vor mer gank gasetsuts hardari arach mer koyutian zara gatsina harets ie menk ska vanas neru yen tagatartsank la diga martkain gorusner ie la diga fizika gan gorusner sho shapeli gorusner vorbes jogurt ie vorbes hai ask Menk yete martkain ka agar tutyan dalik monik. Yevait dalik panagara par astzo mezi devats gyanke imastalis tarzno barkev mane. Betke hokank yev sharnagenk mer hokatsutuna dal mer jovuti betkerun mart kutyan betkerun pais masnaora ves mer jovuti vorun marda haravernera aisor haskayen yev mez skial hayreniken. Եվ դարազվելով սպյուրքի ամպոլոր կաղոտներում մեջ։ Մեր հայրենիք է այսօր մանավանդ, մասնավորապես վդանքներու ենտագա է, դագավին չենք կրնար վդանք է զերց համարել զայն, լա դիկա վիզիկական վդանքները իր թրացիներ են հոլորսալ ընելիք մունինք և այդ ընելիքին կիտակսությունը ունենալով բետք է ծերք երգարենք, բետք է ձարայենք, բետք է ամբայման մեր պաժին նպերենք։ Կոչս այն է, որ մի մնար հերու ձարայության տաշտեն, ամբայման որ են կտնվիլ ամերիկայի այն շրջանի մեջ, որ մենք արդեն վաղոտ շատ սիրելի պարեկաններ ունեցած ենք, ոմանց հետ մեր գավը գաված ենք, ոմանց հետ պոլորովին անչատված ենք, ասեք է արիտ մգուտամեզի, որ վերագանքնենք մեր ասպարեզմը չէ անշուշտ իրամպոչ աշխադանքի դարիներուն ամերիկա պոխատրված որերնես սկսյալ, ինք միշտ իր կմյունիթին, իր շրջանագին ձարայելը, իրեն համար գենսագան 
գետմը եղած է իր կյանքին մեջ, ուրեմ են ինձի համարալ այս նոր շրջանագին մեջ, ամուսին իսկ ողքին նոր պարեգամներով, նոր շրջանակ, նոր եգեղեցի, եգեղեցիներ ավերի ճիշտը միասին լալ վայել էլ, եթե ես անհադավես, որ եվ է ոգտագարություն գրնամպերել, իմ սահմանապակ կարողություններովս հոսեմ։